Hi, I'm Mike. Welcome back to another video. And in this video, we're going to be looking at some cheap $99 trail cameras you can pick up on Amazon. I got the box here in front of me. This is the front of the box. Top of the box. And then here is the back of the box. You can read and see all the specs. Now, this here, you just open it up like this, and they come out, and then that just kind of folds up. I've already took these out of the box, I've used them, tested them, and I got the footage, I'm going to show you how they uh, work, and how good the cameras actually are. So, you just pull the tab off here, and they come in this little half pouch, like that. That's what your package looks like. You get one per box. So, what you get in the box here is two of these mounts. Right here. And they're all metal besides these little plastic pieces right here. These little twisty pieces are plastic, but I've tr tested these and I haven't had any issues with these mounts at all. You get two individual charging cables here and uh, these are actually not charging cables I don't think. These are actually cables that you plug in to the camera and you're able to get the footage off. You're going to get two of those. You get two of these uh, straps to strap it to a tree. And this one here I've already had strapped because I was testing it and I used it. So it's pretty long. It fits around most size trees. How this works is it has this little thing right here and you just snap it. And it works and it holds. You put this in here, just like that, you push this down, clamp it, and it holds. It's not going to go nowhere, I've had no problems with these. You get two of them within the package. Then of course you get some, some instructions. So, you do get screws with these. These you do get screws with, but uh, I had one screw strip out on me. They're very cheap screws. They pack with these things, so don't tighten them too tight like I did, and you'll be just fine. The camera here, here's the actual camera, move these out of the way. And it's camera on the front, of course. You got the sensor up here. And then right here you have the infrared lights for night vision. And then you got the sensor down here that detects when it's uh, mo motion. When an animal goes in front of it to turn the camera on to record. Uh, here on the back end you got this like little grip right here. And this is going to help. So when it touches the tree it sits flat. This is where your strap will go through. It's made out of plastic, this camera, but it's well made. It's not going nowhere. Here on the bottom, you have a standard tripod mount to mount this to a tripod that also mounts it to this thing right here. So you can set it up like that. This gets clamped down. And it holds. Now, take this off. Here, on the side, this just opens like this. You have, when you lock this, a little thing here to put a lock or a little, like, uh, like a tie or something on there so this doesn't open. 
but you just open this up and this will open here and inside here you see this little rubber piece that's for this right here that you open because this has a DC power jack on it so you can plug it in to I think maybe the wall or maybe a solar power to charge this up now I don't know if that's true or not but these are not chargeable batteries so I don't know if that's an option you can buy sold separately I don't know but you put regular batteries in here it takes a standard size SD card here on the bottom is where you plug in that cord that comes with it so you can transfer the footage off this camera if you don't want to pull the SD card out you have a speaker down here you have it looks like an AV jack here so you can plug it into a TV and view the footage it kind of looks like a headphone jack that's what that is now for the actual camera here this is the screen these are the buttons this is very easy to use it's very intuitive it doesn't it's not hard to use the menus are easy it's easy to understand when you tap this top button here it will pull up the menu here in the menu is the top one this will allow you to click either if you want it to take a picture or a video or down here you can have it take pictures and video this one here this when you go here it's going to give you all the video resolution the highest is going to be 20 megapixels so we'll leave it there as you can see there's all these other ones but again you want it set on the highest to get the highest picture down here it's going to say how many pictures do you want to take one two or three you can set it to how many you want there here it allows you to set video resolution you got 480p you got uh, 720p and 1080p resolutions we'll keep it at the highest click this button up here is going to be the OK button now there's all these other settings in here like how long you want the video to record for there's all different types of settings in this thing and then you just go ahead and you tap this button here up here this top one up here actually and it takes you back out now if I slide an SD card in to this that does not come with this by the way so you gotta get your own and you push this in right that like that and now if I tap on this here this is the play button you're going to see here some images that were taken on this camera and to go through them you just go like that and there's a back button so you can back that up now let's say you want to play these images so, okay. if we tap the OK button it'll play you can see right there's a cat neighbor's cat in the video and it plays now to actually stop it you tap the OK tap this button over here and it takes you uh, there it is now it stopped so let's say you want to go ahead and get back to here that's going to be back at the home screen let's say you want to go ahead and delete the footage that's on here tap that button tap the top button and you get into here 
where you're able to delete a single file by clicking OK or if you go down you can tap it right here and delete all of it just like that and it's completely wiped and deleted so that there is how the camera actually works now to get this to record this button right here you tip it all the way over once you set your stuff up and there's a timer for you to walk away from it the timer will go off and then it will start to record when it sees motion the timer is for you to get away from the camera enough time to set the camera up and leave so you're not in the video we're gonna show you some footage I'm gonna show you some footage off this camera here that is So what do I think of these cameras? Well, you really can't go wrong with it for $99. You know, these cameras don't have any of the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, or wireless connectivity to your phone. They don't have any of that. But what it does have is it comes with the two mounts, the two straps, two 1080p trail cameras, and they can take a good, high-quality, acceptable picture. To me, that's good value. I would totally recommend these cameras for anyone looking for good, affordable, cheap trail cameras. These will get the job done. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and click the like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel.